this is the all-seeing eye, the symbol. Uh, you can see it almost everywhere in this world. Uh, it's uh, marked on the one dollar bill and uh, many people choose off this sign in different pictures and uh, it's very common that especially famous people choose off this sign. Uh, they hid one eye, they darken one eye and it represents Lucifer, Satan. So it's satanic and uh, like we can read in the Second Corinthians 4.4, 4, Satan is the god of this world. I read a little from Second Corinthians 4, uh, 3 to 4. But even if our gospel is veiled, it is veiled to those who are perishing, whose minds the God of this age has blinded. The God of this age is Satan. And uh, it's uh, in a prophecy in Zechariah 11.17. Uh, it's about the, com uh, the Antichrist who will come. Uh, uh, many I know speculate uh, it's Obama and if you ask me I don't think so but I'm not sure uh, I'm not sure I am praying about it and so should you do uh, but the most important thing is that you are in the right place with Jesus Christ uh, and then you have nothing to fear about but now I will read the prophecy uh, in Zechariah 11:17, it says about Antichrist, Woe to the worthless shepherd who leaves the flock, a sword shall be against his arm and against his right eye. His arm shall completely wither and his right eye shall be totally blinded. So uh, that's why we can see uh, many who... Uh, are sat satanists uh, who worship Satan, uh, the devil, they uh, choose off one eye, the one eye symbol, the all-seeing eye. Uh, but, you know, it's more than just a picture. That's a very important thing for you to know. It has evil power behind it. And if you are uh, with Jesus Christ, it can't touch you uh, because you are covered by Jesus' uh, uh, protection. But if you are in the dark, it will affect you. It's a witchcraft. And many who do this, they know about it and many don't. So we can also read in the Bible. Proverbs 10.10 10, it says, He who winks with the eye causes trouble, but the prating fool will fall. I say it again, he who winks with the eye causes trouble. I even, an interesting fact is one time I got a dream where I saw the all seeing eye symbol and I heard this verse in the same time and uh, then later on God told me to do a video about it about this subject so it's uh, witchcraft and if you have Jesus in your life you don't need to worry but if you don't you better hurry to Jesus Christ Satan works all the time he never sleeps to bring so many he can uh, down to hell so he can torture those people and uh, so they will not get everlasting life with Jesus Christ and uh, how do we do that he yeah he have a common he have made all the religions in this world except Christianity if you want to call it a religion it's a, a personal relationship with Jesus Christ many prefer to say it that way uh, but all ways that is not following Jesus Christ 
will lead to hell. Like we read earlier, 2 Corinthians 4.4 4 says Satan is the god of this world. And in John 14.6 it says Jesus is the only way to the Father. No one comes to the Father except by, you know, through Jesus Christ. So we can see all those false religions, uh, you know, Catholicism, Jehovah's Witnesses, uh, Satanism, uh, Freemasonry, uh, Islam, uh, atheism, uh, when you don't believe in anything, you know, it's also a religion in the eyes of uh, many people. It, 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 you know, and uh, m many who uh, uh, follow Satan, uh, they meditate and do yoga and stuff like that. And that can open up your, uh, that will open up the third eye, it's also called, in your uh, mind. Uh, that's why we can see many people who are uh, in, in Buddhism and Hinduism, uh, uh, they who practice uh, yoga and stuff, they have, uh, you know, often on, you know, a small uh, little thing behind their eyes, you know, uh, over the nose. Uh, I can show a picture here so you know what I'm talking about. You know, that represents the third eye. And they who have opened up the third eye are under demonic possession. Satan have them and they feel good and uh, stuff like that many times. Uh, but they, they, it's a false happiness and they, they think they are enlightened. And they, that they know stuff that others don't know. But the truth is, if, if you follow Satan directly, if you worship him, or indirectly, that you don't worship him, but still practice yoga and stuff like that, you are under demonic possession. And you are walking in the dark, because Jesus is the light. It, the Bible clearly says that. Uh, if you walk with him, you walk in the truth. And uh, many believe they can be La like gods if uh, if they uh, open up the third eye and they will level up like you can call it uh, like it, in Genesis 3 5 we can read that uh, you know I can read for God knows that in the day you, you eat of it your eyes will be opened Satan said to Eve and you will be like God, knowing good and evil. So they was fool, fooled, Adam and Eve, to think they, they, they would be like God. If they ate of the forbidden fruit, you know. Uh, but they didn't, they died. Uh, and uh, it's a lie, no one can be like God, no one. Uh, the, the, it's one place in our brain, it's called penal gland. And this is uh, the, the th way that will be activated, so to say, uh, when you uh, do yoga and uh, search after to be enlightened and when the demon, demons uh, and Satan possess possess you. That's called the third eye. You know, you can see and feel the, the other dimension, so to say, uh, but it's not no good, you know, it's all bad and it leads to hell. And uh, I will read what the Bible says in Ephesians 6.12. For we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this age, against spiritual hosts of wickedness in the heavenly places. So remember that. And now I will go on and talk a little about the 
klimataktivist Greta Thunberg. Who are, uh, who, she uh, is um, coming from Sweden uh, and uh, she do the will of uh, the father of the darkness. Uh, Satan, I mean. Uh, it's no klim climate uh, threat in this world. In, in Genesis, in the Bible, we can clearly read that uh, God has promised us to uh, that winter and summer and uh, every different climate will exist until the end of this world. It will not, not disappear until Jesus has returned. No one can change that. Okay, you can be good and uh, uh, throw the garbage where you sh should, you know, uh, but, but you don't need to worry about uh, uh, a new ice age, a uh, new, it hasn't even been an ice age, by the way, it's uh, evolution lie. Uh, but, you know, you don't need to worry. And this girl, Greta Thunberg, I will she uh, is worthy of an Oscar domination, a nomination I mean, because her outstanding acting performance in the UN. Let's see. I shouldn't be up here. I should be back in school on the other side of the ocean. Yet you all come to us young people for hope. How dare you? You have stolen my dreams and my childhood with your empty words. And yet, I'm one of the lucky ones. People are suffering. People are dying. Entire ecosystems are collapsing. We are in the beginning of a mass extinction. And all you can talk about is money and fairy tales of eternal economic growth. How dare you? I mean, you can see that she's not serious. It's people behind Gre Greta uh, with uh, a lot of power and money who is behind this nonsense uh, to control the masses, to bring fear in us and to obey the government. We should go obey the government in, in uh, many ways, uh, the Bible says, but <laughs> Not when it comes to wicked stuff. And this is a beginning of total controlation. Uh, uh, this is a, has an evil agenda behind it. Uh, like I said, it's not exist any climate change. And let's see when Greta Thunberg uh, is. Uh, I think it's uh, a hidden camera. And uh, one person says that. Uh, brings up her uh, diagnosis uh, uh, that she is mentally ill, you know, like she has sa said herself. We can see that clip first. I fell into depression, I stopped talking, and I stopped eating. In two months, I lost about 10 kilos of weight. Later on, I was diagnosed with Asperger's syndrome, OCD, and selective mutism. That it's appropriate to have a sort of a child who talked about mental illness and be exploiting it in such a way. You know, taking her around the country, sort of whoever gives you a Tesla, do you think that that's appropriate when you've talked about Greta's mental illness? I don't have a mental illness. <laughs> you don't have severe autism? That sort of was the. So you think that it's completely acceptable to be bringing a 16-year-old across the country? I brought him, actually. Yeah. Okay, she says, when uh, the interviewer says, the guy with the camera says, you know, uh, 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 brings it up, you know, uh, about she has me mental illness. She laughs about it, you know, uh, and uh, then she, she, she says, it's not uh, a mental illness. But... Uh, in the, uh, from I, I can't say she have or haven't ha, have not you know but I can say what I think I believe she's a liar when it comes to that I don't believe in that 
And I, I have heard that she, uh, her grades from school uh, is probably fake too. And I know for sure that it's fake. Uh, the 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 things about the climate, you know, that's a hoax. It's uh, lies. It's evil propaganda. That's how it is. And you could see that, you know, she even shows up the all-seeing eye in the cover of a, a, a magazine. She is with the dark side. She follows the leaders of this world. And uh, they follow Satan. And that's the way she walks after Satan. God bless you everyone and have a good day. Bye.